Hello, David Srotsky for The Bond Experience. Welcome back. You know, I'm in London, back in London. And one of the things that I love to do when I'm in London is to, of course, walk around. It's actually a beautiful day. It's a day after some serious rain, and I love to go to the brands. And one of the first places I have to start in a brand walk, it's kind of the mecca of James Bond brands, none other than Burlington Arcade. And every now and then you get people photobombing like Mike Poplowski. You can't keep them out of London, folks. So we are on the world famous German street right now. This place is replete with, is that the right word? Probably not, with James Bond brands. You've got everything from Floris, to Loke, to Lobs, to Bates, to Davidoff, and of course, the world famous Turnbull and Asser shirt makers. That's where we're going to next, but let's take it all in. It's absolutely beautiful. Okay, so now we're in the Hippodrome and we got a little fan gathering called <laughs> Tune Raker, where we're actually going to be connecting with people, Bond fans, it's the calm before the storm, but check this out, we've got some limited edition Tune Raker Marines, just like from Moonraker, except it's Tune Raker. We've got the early birds here, let's see who shows up, you never know who's going to be a part of these type of mixes. Okay, so we've officially moved up from, I don't know, second floor, third floor, I lose track to the fifth floor, open air, look at that, look at that, hold on, we got the Hippodrome, 
sign of things to come in the background. But most importantly, behind me is the best view of all. We've got just a few of some really great friends all enjoying themselves, trying to act all casual. They can't act casual. Let's head into the crowd and see who's here. You never know who you're going to meet. Look at this guy, fully dressed up like no time to die. A general practitioner. Do you think you might have to like help somebody? Do you think we're too A few more drinks. A few more drinks. I know. I'm going to be looking out for that. Thanks for coming. You got people from all over enjoying themselves. Some people that have brought friends as well. We've got people that have some of the biggest poster collections in the entire, is it UK? We don't exaggerate. We were about to say the world, but that would have been the biggest bond collection. See, that, that's a big, big discerning thing. And we've got friends, we've got family, we've got people that have just gone really crazy and become entirely head to toe a quantum of solace, which is absolutely insane. I mean, is this something that you were looking forward to do, that this is the time to wear this outfit? I think today is the day when uh, you've got to deliver on uh, what you're into, if, if, it's, uh, if it's possible. So, yeah, yeah. Glad, to, glad, to, glad to be of service. Uh, and it's a safe place, yeah, wouldn't yeah, you yeah. say? I, mean, I this think is, so. I mean, you can wear your... Is that an NPL that you're wearing? No, unfortunately not. It's I'm sorry, we're going to have to move on. Sale, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, we're sponsored here. We've got it. <laughs> It's Charles to work with you. Yes, yes. Yeah. And it was Another half price, so I couldn't resist it. Half price. I mean, that's a good excuse right then and there. <laughs> exactly. NPL, learn your lesson. I have no idea who these two are right here, <laughs> but they look familiar. It looks like AJ and Phil, but I we, could be we, wrong. We thought time we was a new present. We um, this is the past, and this is the future. I love it. Why is this almost like, like devilish we're lights? Under, we're chickens. Chicken. We're chicken lambs. Like we're going to grow. I, I, my I, hair's going to grow. I'm going to hold my time, Mr. Chairman. I resent everyone. Uh, <laughs> any, any relation yeah, yeah. to the room? He's got his attorney, attorney, attorney hat on. We're going to move on from that then. We've got Mark all the way from the United States. This guy has been to so many of these different things. You miss a couple from time to time. Next time for sure. All right, we're still moving through the crowd. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my gosh, as I live and breathe, Mark O'Connell. Don't worry about it. This could be anywhere. Hello. 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 We just moved up. Well, this is an upgrade. Now we're going to see the O2 yeah. arena from here. You can see it. Yeah, you can. You can see the top. There's the top right there. That's the crane. That's the room. That's not the O2. Is it not? If it was, um, this is what happens when a gang does this type of stuff. The O2 is a bit more further on. You've just done the Brannigan John Wayne London, where everything's within four meters. I thought it was a four-block area. I didn't John Brannigan John Wayne stuff. No, no. That's, if it was, I'm like, fuck me, my eyesight's good. But that's the building site. Yeah. Well, that's what we do. All right, I'm going to see what else is going on here. Stay tuned. Okay, of course, I'm here with none other than Elliot Mason. Elliot, good to see you, my and brother. You, and you. This is always such a pleasure visiting him, especially in this spot right in the heart of London. And there's a special treat. So by the time you're seeing this video, many people have seen me in a beautiful, right here, midnight blue tuxedo, the Dr. No dinner suit. I gotta stop calling it a tuxedo. It's a dinner suit, right? <laughs> That's the term for it? Well, when you're in England, I suppose we should. Yeah, it's not like, you know, this, this is not a sweater, it's a jumper. <laughs> so one of the great things is Elliot has just measured me and nearly overnight or kind of overnight we're going to have a suit that fits me yes there's a show in the uk that used to run called blue peter and they often used to say here's one uh, we made earlier so uh here's one we made earlier and we will quickly adjust the sleeve and trouser length of course making them much longer for you you sir i'm statuesque uh, you yes, can tell yeah right and, and uh taking in the waist quite a lot of course <laughs> and uh and then it'll be ready for you on well, I'll be ready tomorrow evening. I'll have it delivered to your hotel. It's unbelievable. The, the, the service, this is what I talk about when I say customer experience. So amazing product. It has to be a good product to start with. And then when you put 
customer experience and performance on top of that, and then good people, it's kind of the perfect gem <laughs> in the crown. But how popular is this dinner suit for people? Do you get quite a few um, requests? We probably, I would say of all the dinner suits we make, 90% of them are this dinner suit. Oh my gosh. But without changing any of the styling details, they want it screen accurate. Yes. Um, and then out of all of the tailoring that we do, it's probably, I would say in the top three or four items. So we, we're making these constantly, no matter what time of year it is, all year round we make them. Unbelievable. No, I'm very excited. Well, you'll see it in live action at the O2 Arena with the big concert coming up. We'll see you there. So here I am in London. I received a package in my room when I checked in and uh, there was a box and the box is from our good friends at the London Stock Exchange. And it is the first time I am seeing what's in this box. Probably any Bond fan is seeing. So we're getting a kind of a exclusive your eyes for your eyes only. And it is a new pair of socks. Oh, <laughs> I did not even know that was going to be there. For your feet only, stand corrected. Look at that, 007. Nice little welcome. Anything on the back? Well, yes, there is. The 007 heraldry set. What is this, people? Part of our exclusive 007 collection. These socks are all set to emblazon your feet with two timeless emblems of Bond style. What? They've been inspired by Bond's mission to On Her Majesty's Secret Service, 1969, to infiltrate Blofeld's lair. High in the Swiss Alps, 007 assumes the identity of Sir Hilary Bray from the College of Arms in London. Acting as Sir Hilary, his task is to help establish Blofeld's claims to the noble title of Count Balthazar de Blochamp. But in reality, Bond is there to uncover and ultimately foil Blofeld's plan for global chaos and destruction. What follows is one of Bond's most iconic emotive adventures, and we're thrilled to celebrate it through the medium of sustainability made meticulous finish socks. Amazing. Oh, oh, very nice touch. Orbis non that The world is not enough. Which, by the way, is extremely interesting for today since we're playing at the O2 Arena this concert and I'm emceeing. So it's a very world is not enough place. And we have the Hillary crest of Sir Hillary Bray, the Hillary crest, the Bond family crest. World is not enough. We couldn't agree more. And then of course, ooh, you got the nefarious Blofeld. And we'll read those a little bit later, but let's get to the, uh, the main course. So this, oh, come on people. Seriously? I'm sorry, as a Bond fan, I am absolutely geeking out here. First of all, 007 paper, got to get into the details. But look at these. You got the Bond crest. You've got the Blofeld crest or the Blochamps. And these things look amazing. I love the colors. It's almost like a, a wine mauve color. And this is like a wonderful blue. And you want to know something. I've got a very special night ahead of me where I'm wearing a tuxedo. I'm going to break these in for the first time and everybody around me won't even know because that I'm wearing these socks because I can't show these socks yet until they premiere. So let's go try these on in all their glory. Okay, okay. Already, I chose to work with Anthony Sinclair in recreating the Dr. No shawl collar 
dinner suit, dinner jacket, dinner pants. I've got very simple white pocket square. I've got the bat wing in midnight blue. Yeah, very unusual, not used to that. I've got the pearl cufflinks, just like in Dr. No. And of course the whole suit. Yeah, it's an Anthony Sinclair designed suit replica from all the way back in 1962 with Dr. No's Sean Connery. It's got the same blue, but also the shawl lapels are blue. And I even have a voile, simple shirt, no pearls, just pearl buttons as my shirt. And it's Turnbull and Asser, simple black patent shoes. Folks, I'm going like almost like full Dr. No as a harken back. But of course I had to put my own touch on this, but because in Quantum of Solace, not a lot of people realize this, in Quantum of Solace, they had an homage to the Dr. No shawl collar. It looked exactly like this same color, different company, Brioni. And because of that, I'm wearing my Quantum watch. The homage, the Dr. No, the celebration of Bond, it's all coming together. I have my dinner suit. I'm gonna head out to the O2 Arena. Anything can happen at this point, and usually does. whistling that when I do this. Tell me you don't do that too. You do. So I come out of my hotel and uh, yeah, this is sitting here in the parking lot. You know, just a childhood dream come true. Nothing much. Herbie. Okay, you can tell in the back of here, that is the O2 Arena. We're gonna be going to the Indigo Theater. It's the smaller of the two theaters. We've let Madonna actually go into the larger one. That's just how we roll. We're kind like that. But the concert spectacular, the cue, the music is going to be in the Indigo. And look at that. I'm getting major, major, the world is not enough vibes. Here I am decked out in my tuxedo to ready to go. But I got to get inside because we have dress rehearsal, fully kitted out. I'm ready to go. Okay, I'm in the green room. Nothing green about this, but it's a nice room. Got really relaxing Bond-like chairs. We've got a full kitchen. We've got drinks and snacks. And this is where people will sit until they go on. If they're ready to go on, I'll be mostly on. So I'll probably be on stage most of the time. But it's a nice, comfortable place. And the band is, they're getting set up. They're getting tuned. There's so much technology. There's so much prep that goes involved that people don't appreciate. You come in, you listen to our concert, you enjoy, you leave you go get a libation. Here, it takes months, sometimes over a year to plan something like this out. And then there's a lot of setup and that's what they're doing right now. Amazing. So when you MC something like this, they tend to spoil you. Check this out. David and Warren, don't go, hold on. This is totally, hey, hey people in La La Land. Check this out. You got Warren's dinner suit. You've got my, Lady Gaga type change of wardrobe. But look at this, this is kind of a cool room. You got, you could watch the show up here. You can see when you're gonna be needing on, or you just need a, a little time to get away. Every now and then you need a little time to get away. Some cold drinks. This'll do me, this'll do me quite well. Uh-huh, yeah. Okay, here's my rehearsal. Here we go. Hello. As you heard, my name is David Zritsky, and I am a Bond fan, which sounds a little bit like a confession, which maybe it is. I don't know. My name is David Zritsky, and it's been two weeks since my last Bond film. Hi, David. No, it's, it's really, it's, it's an important point, because tonight is a night that is created for Bond fans by Bond fans. And what I'm trying to say is that this is a, everybody here is fans. In fact, if you think about it, James Bond is the great equalizer. It doesn't matter if you walked through the door, whatever, that doesn't matter what profession, what religion, what proclivities you came with. What brings us all together is the passion for James Bond. Well, all right, let's be transparent. Not all of you 
share the same passion is tonight is about storytelling the best of storytelling storytelling through music storytelling through songs storytelling through anecdotes from James Bond alumni and of course escapism I mean we're not gonna get into that tonight I'm gonna put that aside because the other thing this is about is about celebration I mean we to this year we can't forget we're celebrating three German three Look at and our next right, that's generally it I'm feeling pretty good I'm gonna do this like 10 more times Blah. Thanks for watching this episode. If you want to be up on the latest from the Bond experience, just click on this subscribe and subscribe to our channel. You're going to get all the latest and greatest information plus some exclusive content. And by the way, speaking of content, here's something especially for you just because we know you. Talk to you soon.